Making sure you complete your race properly will help you have a better chance of reaching your goals. Why do it? The race isn't over until you touch the wall, and anything that delays that finish can add tenths of a second in a sport that's decided by hundreds. How to do it. All great finishes begin with an awareness of where you are as you approach the wall. Make sure you start practicing your finishes outside the flags, on all strokes. Place yourself outside the flags, and you can jump into the swim to practice your finishes. Remember, you'll get all the air you need after the finish, so there is no breathing from the flags into the wall. The goal is to finish with your eyes down, body rotated, and arm fully extended as you touch the wall. How to do it really well, the fine points. In practice, always be aware that every time you finish a swim in a set, you're practicing your finish. Don't miss the opportunity to gain insight on all the variations that need to be learned to have great finishes. You'll need to know how to do a great finish based on how fast you're going, what your stroke rate is, where you are in your stroke when you pass under the flags, and with all that, know instinctively if you should target for one more stroke or one less stroke. This instinct only happens if you practice this every time you come to the wall.